Halfway through the mining season, 26-year-old Parker Schnabel Good boy. faces a do-or-die moment. Mud Mountain is a big project, probably a bit bigger than I thought it was going to be. And there's still a lot of dirt to move. He has to finish stripping the 60-foot deep mud mountain in the next month, or he won't have time to sluice it before the end of the season when his lease runs out. Come on. And any gold left behind will be someone else's to mine. I already paid royalties on this stuff at Mud Mountain, so I only have to get it done this year. And the clock on the season's definitely ticking. But his whole crew is already flat out, running his two wash plants, Slucifer and Big Red. What's happening? How are you guys? We got a problem. Mud Mountain, like, that is a this season thing. We have to go in there and get it done, or else we lose hundreds of thousands of dollars, more likely in the millions. We need people and machines, and we just don't have anybody. The only solution I've come up with is we're, we got to shut a plant down. Free up some machines and people. Yeah, I think Slucifer. It's the real manpower suck. Yeah. Yep. Shut down a plant. Now is the prime sluicing time, right? No, I think it's definitely a gamble. Yep. Shutting down Slucifer will cost Parker $100,000 a day in unmined gold. But it's his only option if he wants to sluice Mud Mountain this year. I don't like saying we bit off more than we can chew, but we did. Mud Mountain has to get done. You know, it's definitely a first shutting down a wash plant halfway through the season. And chancing something like this, you know it's going to drop to minus 20 on us. Right now is prime sluicing season. We have 24 hour daylight, good thaw going on, and to shut one plant down, that's, that's risky business right there. <laughs> 